What is going on? Ciao, it is your most, yes, your most favorite already YouTuber in the whole entire world. Back with another video. Now, today, I do have another rash reel for y'all. But, of course, this one is a little bit different. This one's a little bit different because, apparently, 1090J came out and said rappers are scared to fight him. Now, I would say it's because he feels that he's menacing. But, more specifically, it's because he says you lose to a white boy, your career is over. Now, I don't know how necessarily true that is. Obviously, I can't fully speak on that shit. But low-key, I kind of see where he's coming from, but I don't think it's that damn drastic. Unless, you know, it's like an alleged street rapper. That's the only time I could see that shit really affecting him. But at the same time, you got some white boys that are, you know. But I don't really know what the whole deal is. But I am kind of curious to see how he says it and all that. So, yeah, let's get into it. Before I do, shout out to DJ Vlad for the video we are reacting to. Of course, go check out his channel. Go subscribe. Go like the video. Go do all the goodness, of course. But before we get into that, I don't hate anybody that he's talking about or we're listening to or anything. So, yeah, I'm just going to be brutally honest with y'all. And I just had to say that it's all love, but let's get into it and figure out how this actually is, you know, coming out. All right, y'all. No more hesitations. Let's get into the video now. After going through this, and years later, you've matured, you've grown, would you ever pull up on someone again in a similar situation? Nah. Well, I didn't pull up, but I would just have a security guard or a fucking little Tim just go hand in hand with that. You know what I'm saying? I'm not... It's not gonna do anything for me, and like you said, all it's gonna do Man, is just put me in a bad position. Soul is everything, in my opinion. Wait, but why even show up? If it gets level? to that like, level, I ain't even been to that level, but I'd rather I have do gone that. Back and forth with lots of people on the internet, some of which are major celebrities, some of which are nobodies. Right. Pretty much in every case, I can't think of a case where this doesn't apply. If we ever saw each other in public, I would honestly think it's no big deal. Yeah, well, I mean, I'm going to be honest, though. After that, like, I done got in tour with a whole bunch of rappers. None of them have ever hit me up privately wanting to do anything, you know? So at least with him, he came. That's about the only thing I can respect is he showed up. How he showed up or how it went or whoever he needed with him, that's another discussion. No, but I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I got to stop it. Oh, no disrespect, because we low-key fan, whatever, you know. But some of the comments, I seen this shit pop up. They said that he low-key looks like the Penguin. And I just started watching that series. I ain't gonna lie, that shit good as hell. But he, I ain't gonna lie, dude, especially with the stance he's in. I see it. I definitely see it, low-key. And no disrespect because I'm ugly as fuck, but you know, it's all jokes. But I see that shit. Damn. Oh, man. It elevated after that, though. I was like, and I once don't you know. get into the rap of it's like, we know like... we're not fighting. You get beat by a white boy, your whole career just died. So it's like, man. it just goes to an extreme level. And then at that point, you gotta, all right, is it worth it at all? Like, nah, it's not. Maybe. I don't know. I mean, honestly, if I were to name a rapper, who actually does everything he raps about in real life, you got to give it to the baby. Yeah. You roll up on the baby at a, at a bowling alley, talk about, would you say about my sister? The baby will put hands on you right yeah, there. He's, he's, he's beating shit, popping shit. He's fucking, yeah. Yeah, well, you I mean, the baby's the baby smart. He knows the damn laws and shit. His kids, and you so, flash a gun, he will kill you in All that right. Walmart. He's gonna put you in the ground. He's gonna put you in the ground, and then he's gonna write a song about it. Yeah. Dance, everything. <laughs> yeah, Dance, you show up everything. to the baby's house to do a home invasion, he will shoot at you. And then talk about it in a Vlad TV interview. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, I'm going to say this. The baby is the realest rapper of all time. I'm going to give him that title. Shout, Shout out, out to, to all the, the baby. real rappers out there. The Gucci's and the, you know, Boosies. the Beanie Seagulls and the Boosies and everything. Right, go on praising. Just, but yeah, no, I mean, dude, shout out to the baby. I ain't gonna lie. The baby just got that, like, 
genuine personality where I fuck with him. So, you know, shout out to the baby. But in general, he really didn't explain too farther. He just kind of standing on the whole fact that nobody wants to get beat up by a white boy. But he's not saying that he would, I'm not even sure if he would win. Like, if we're putting up, I don't even know who knew, who knew, who knew ugh, learn this bit of kicking in. Like, a bit. Like, I don't even know who he's beefing with beefing with so like i don't want to say he would lose to them but like you know sometimes maybe that matchup ain't matching up so who says they would lose to you but in general i think he yeah got a little point but at the same time i don't know for sure that's for y'all to let me know in the comments down below but in general i just think that's another way of saying i don't want to fight them either at the same time that's what i'm thinking he's saying but you know i get it i get it. i don't know but I do want to know what y'all think in the comment section down below. Also, in the comments, come and shoot boy, make and make all kinds of different videos. So, comment what you want to see. And, uh, yeah, that's all I got for the video. Peace.